Well, hello. Welcome back to another exciting edition of Coffee with Stephen. So this week's blog is entitled, My Beautiful Balloon. And you, uh, you probably have a good guess as to what it is we're talking about this week. So a lot of my readers and our clients here at Artemis have been emailing me or coming into my office and saying to me with extreme trepidation, what are your thoughts about this Chinese, you know, incursion into our airspace or, you know, this alien invasion or us shooting down kids' science projects or whatever your uh, particular conspiracy theory happens to be on this. Um, and probably the best way that I could really discuss this was to do another blog where the colonel and I have a discussion in front of the fireplace and the officers club. And many of you who've read the blog regularly have seen this trope before. Um, so in this blog, you know, Cosmo, Colonel Taramina and I are having this discussion about the, uh, the Chinese balloon that we had just recently shot down. And, uh, and how an intelligence operation it has to, you have to be very, very careful because if the operation is subsequently discovered, the very fact that the operation existed to perform a particular function allows the target to understand the limits of your knowledge about their activities. Lists are very, very dangerous because a list doesn't only tell the person what you would like to know, the list tells the person what you don't know. So there's a, there's a complexity associated with this whole thing. And uh, in, the, in the discussion that the Colonel and I are having, we look at the balloon as effectively being a Chinese list. Uh, the argument being that the balloon itself was never a signals intelligence apparatus. It wasn't designed to look for unique signatures of uh, radioactivity on the ground and where our ICBMs were located or everything like that. That the real test that the balloon was trying to do was to see how we would react if a balloon came over the United States. And in fact, there might have been some, uh, disc you know, some uh, level of aggression on the part of the Chinese, realizing, at least at the beginning, that we weren't doing anything, that we didn't even know that the balloon was there, and that they might have been the ones who leaked it to the media to kind of gin up some sort of a, 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 an anger among the American population to demand some sort of response so they could see how we would ultimately respond. In any event, uh, the blog is somewhat tongue-in-cheek. Uh, you know, hopefully, you'll understand the underlying humor behind it. I do encourage you to read it, as I always do. Um, and it will be coming out on Wednesday at ArtemisHQ.com forward slash blog. As always, train constantly, train consistently, train repetitively, and train with purpose. Above all else, stay safe.